Hey yo to her and welcome to the StarCraft 2 diary. Hmm. Uh, let's see what do we have here. Yeah. So I'm I'm on NA currently and I'm going to play a little bit of Mac, trying out the new patch. And also we got some new maps around here. For example, Battle on the Boardwalk LE, which is a really strange map, I have to say. And I don't know if I should like this one or not. But we're gonna find out, just testing it out. So for that reason I think I... Uh, maybe you can veto Ascension to a U. It's not a bad map, but for Mac, I don't know. The fourth base is quite spread out. Actually, this map is quite good for Mac, I think. I've seen some good Mac games on it, so it, it, I will stick to it. Uh, Blackpink, no idea. Auto say, straightforward. This one, weird as something. Uh, Catalyst, I don't know about this one. Uh, could be, could be possible. Really strange map. And Neon Violet Square, Ooh. interesting, definitely, but I don't know either. Very open. Oh no, that's that stupid map. So there are quite strange maps, I have to say. But we will just test them out, test them out, and see how it goes. Because I have no, no clue at all. So we will just have to see. And I did change quite a lot with this patch. Currently, as it stands, if you if you listen to a professional player, they tell you. That Terran is quite weak at the moment. That's a bit sad, but we will see if that's true. And yeah, they did change quite a lot, so I will just go into ranked diary as that, and we will see how it goes. I have no clue, but we will find out. Maybe maybe Terran isn't so weak in the lower leagues now. They they changed the Raven, so the Seeker missile does now less damage but reduces the armor it shreds armor of all units hit by three points so that's a nice utility item it shreds the armor for 21 seconds so it definitely lasts for a fight how useful this is gonna be with bio i, I don't know mm. because seeker missile has such a long cast time i mean it's cast and then it stays there and stays there and stays there until it weep explodes, moves and explodes, that's the problem. Um, there's a new spell like, if you played Brood War you will know the... in, in German it was called Stopper uh, ability, which can cast uh, be cast on mechanical units. It's similar to that, but the moon unit hit can still move, that's the difference. But can't attack, nor cast spells or use abilities, so that's nice. And it lasts only for 6 seconds, so... And it's a single target spell. I'm not sure about this one. It only costs 50 energy, but... Uh, the Ghost got reworked a little bit. Starts with Cloak available instantaneously. But... There are no... There are... Uh, only 50 energy now, so no instant EMP. Unless you get the reactor, the plus 25 energy as the upgrade in the Ghost Academy. So there is no... There is no... Okay, that was our game. No, of course not. Don't know what that was. Oh, that, that guy was highly ranked. Holy. Okay, so I'm rank 3, tier 3 again. Interestingly. With Mac. And my opponent, Master League, yeah. MR. Ah, is this now the, the bar to see? Oh, he was. He was GM once. Okay. We will see, we'll see. So, they everything new again. So, that's fun. Okay, so TVZ, whatever. So, the ghost is, is changed quite a lot. I don't think that the ghost is super strong against Zerg. Probably not. And the rest, I don't know. We will, we will have to see how this plays out or not. So I hope I did switch around. 
That's the... No, I didn't. Why? Now I did. Okay. So that's really important. I don't know if I did good luck, have fun. Normally I should, yeah. Okay. So, against Zerg, Bio is not dead, but it's not necessarily viable. I don't know. Anymore. We will see. We definitely will have to see how this is going. Because currently I can't tell you. I can't tell you if that's looking good or not. So we will just... We will see? I don't know. I definitely will play Mac. I said this is this is the diary on NA playing currently, which means I'm going to try out Mac. I will try out the new Raven. The Liberator got a little bit tweaked and worked, so, so that's oops, I don't know, a little bit strange. I haven't played for weeks again because of reasons, and oh, that's late. That is late. So it should be a pool first, I guess. Yeah, okay. So that definitely looks like a pool first. So the Reaper will stay at home. That should be fine. At least I hope so. And I don't... Whoa, didn't get the Reaper. What? It's not, yeah, okay. It's, it's not a big deal, but actually it's quite a big deal. Okay. They also did... What? change the mineral fields you see they got now 1800 here the large ones instead of 1500 so that's a big change so you will be able to stay longer on the basis you do but it definitely affects uh, something your base a little bit So that should be fine. I'm so glad I was able to deflect that attack. I scouted it, so this this should be normal. But how I I'm how I'm going to mech? I don't know. We we will see. Probably, probably with uh, Hellions and a Banshee. But I don't know. I don't know. Okay, there's nothing. That's interesting. So where is everything? This guy is master. I, I think he, he is. She, whatever. So no base. That that already is a little bit strange. Maybe I can stick a drone. So he definitely is attacking. Yeah. He definitely is attacking, as you can see. With those units, and he definitely can do this. It's it's fine. I think I have to pull some units there to repair. But he's not coming through, actually. So I don't know if that was potentially good or not. I also did save those guys somehow, but that's nice. Uh, the Reaper. I don't know what he's doing next. Extractor going high. Okay. Oh yeah, that's a problem now. And supply cap. Oh yeah, not good. Let's get another base here. And then maybe the Viking to clear some stuff. So maybe I can deal some pesky damage here. I don't know. If I can force the cancel on that one, that would be nice. And with the Banji, I potentially can. Maybe not, we will see. So it's morphing. Uh, 
Okay. So I got a queen that is expensive, yes. But it's not bad, I would say. Okay. And you know what? One bench is enough for me now. We did get a slow start. Maybe goes in with Mutalisks next. This could be the case. Could you please? Hello. Okay. I don't know if I'm playing good here or not, but we definitely will find out soon enough. Whoa, that, that was bad. Oh no! It's not good what I'm doing here. Definitely not good. Okay, so let's see. There he is. And there are the Mutalis. Okay, never mind. I can, I can, I can work with that. So, where's my Viking? I need the Viking back. Okay. So I got the turrets in place, I would say. Yeah, that's nice. Okay, that's not too bad. I definitely could be dead. So I don't know how hard he will go into... into Mutalist there. I am willing, however, to... I like the Cyclone now. It's not, it's not bad. I would say it's really not that bad. Maybe another turret here and one more turret there. I don't know. No, no. I don't know. I'm bunkering in myself hard. He definitely will switch. That's for sure. So I need to take a base ASAP. Yeah, but is, is it worth? That's the problem. I definitely need some Thor here. That's important. And maybe some more Cyclones. So let's try to grab a base. Do I have some Hellions? Yes. It might not be wise whatever I'm trying to do here. But I'm, I'm willing to try at least, you know? At least I'm willing to try. I think... Okay, there are the, the roaches. So he's, he's doing good damage. Okay. I don't know if that's working out or not. I'm just trying. And he's losing all his mutalists basically for free. So now I can kill all of those units. I hope I do have... Yeah, I do have. Okay. Uh, maybe there's not a good space. Maybe there's better. I don't know. I don't have a raven currently. I know. But... I will try to move in and kill a base there. Oh, he's so strong. Oh, wow, he has so much stuff. So, his upgrades may be bad, but it doesn't matter because he just has so much stuff. And that's GG. Oh, yo. Whew, okay. So. I know my mech is really bad. However... So, that that's the problem. The Mutalisk... You never know, are they switching or not. I was way too... Can you please... This is so annoying. 
I was way too late on my tanks. Also on the third base, way too late. I think the opening was okay. But the Mutalis definitely dealt some damage. The workers were fine somewhat, but not really good. The problem with Maggots is such a... Slow... Style. Oh my goodness. Yeah, the upgrades were super bad. And you can't really deal damage against Zerg, I feel like. It's not really possible. So with some tanks, maybe a little bit more depot walls, yes. I had the minerals, but not the gas. And I should have not gone into super heavy cyclones. Cyclones are very bad units. They don't do anything for you. You can have one or two early on, that's it. So I was way too heavy on Cyclones. The Thor... Yeah, maybe one Thor would have been enough to rest the rest As you say, as you saw, I just had two Thor, this would have been two tanks. Against all those Roaches, that, this does nothing. Cancelling the base was nice. The Mutalists dealt no real damage, they were a little bit annoying. That's it. But then going into Vikings... No... What would have helped after the 1 2 Vikings? Uh, good, okay, I, I caught. If it didn't have the Vikings and the Cyclones, I wouldn't have been able to kill the Mutalisk. So going into Banji then would have been also bad. I don't know, I don't know. I will I will have to see. But for now, this is it with this episode. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. As always, I wish you a winner say and goodbye. Hey, there, thank you for watching. If you'd like to support me, simply hit the thumbs up button. Do you have any wishes, feedback or suggestions, put them into the comments below. You may also subscribe if you're new to the channel. I wish you a wonderful and stress-free day. Take care. Bye bye.